With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The given question is a YouTube in which the cross-sectional area of the limb on the left is one quarter. The limb on the right contains mercury. The density of mercury is given. The level of mercury in the narrow limb is at a distance of 36 cm from the upper end of the tube. What will be the rise in the level of mercury in the right limb if the left limb is filled to the top with water? Okay, so we are given a YouTube section in which uh, two limbs are there. Uh, let's say the first limb is of A1 area and another limb of A2 area in which we are given a2 is 4 times of A1. Okay. Now in the left limb we have mercury up till this level as shown in the figure. And we have filled water. Okay. In the uh, left limb uh, like shown in the water uh, like shown in the figure. And we have to find the rise in the level of the mercury in the right limb. So see when we will place the water over mercury there will be some rise in the level of mercury. Okay. Let's say the rise is x now when we are placing the water this mercury see if there is rising in the level of mercury then there will be some drop in the level of mercury in the left limb right and this drop will not be same see because the area of cross section of both the limbs are different so let me assume that it is at a distance something y okay but see the volume of the mercury that was displaced from here will be equal to the volume of the mercury that is being risen up here okay see volume of mercury here and here will be same so if i equate the volumes of the mercury i will get this a1 into y this is the volume of mercury in the left limb and this must be equal to a2 into x okay the volume that is displaced from here must have come up here so from here if i put the value a1 equals to 4 into a2 is given as 4 times of a1 into x from here a1 and a1 will be cancelled out and we will get y equals to 4 times of x okay let this be equation number one see further uh, we have to find the rise in the level of mercury okay now mercury is at this level okay and up till this level this portion is now filled with water okay and this height initially was given to be 36 centimeter now if let's say this point is p then here also the pressure at points p and q must be same because both are mercury okay so uh, by the pascal's law the pressure at point p and the pressure at point q must be same okay so if i write the pressure at point p it would be equal to the p naught that is atmospheric pressure plus the depth of the water that is 36 plus y 36 see pressure at point p we can write as here it will be p naught and we have to go up till this height so reaching at p we will have to cross a distance of 36 plus y then multiply by the rho the density of water into g okay this is h rho g and for q we will have atmospheric pressure p naught plus this distance would be x and this distance is y so we will have x plus y into rho of mercury hg into gravity g so on equating this p naught and p naught will be cancelled out and i can directly write this as 36 plus y can be replaced by 4x into rho of water into g equal to this will become x plus 4x that is 5x into rho of hg into g so here g term will also cancel out and further on solving this we will get 36 plus 4x into the density of water is 1 gram per cubic centimeter equals to 5x into the density of hg is given as 13.6 so this will be 13.6 so from here we will get 36 plus 4x equals to this will become 13 into 5 65 this is 68 x okay so we will get 64 x equals to 36 and on solving this we will get x equals to 
zero point five six centimeter. Okay, so this will be the rise in the level of the mercury in the right limb. So from the given options A, B, C, and D, option C will be the correct answer. Thank you. For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.